It began with a celebration. Indebted for years to the Marquis de la Montalban, a family's prosperity was soon to be restored. Their fleet was due to arrive on the morrow, carrying both their hopes and their salvation. But the celebration was befouled by an unwelcome guest. The Marquis himself arrived bearing ill tidings. Their fleet had been lost. And the debt had come due. The family's prosperity was seized. And they were pressed into bondage. But one of them would not be a slave. And so it was that the brave young Scion escaped his family's fate, swearing to save them and one day avenge the Marquis's foul deed. Ten years later, now grown to his full measure, the young adventurer began his quest to find his family and restore their fortune. What is up, guys? Welcome to Grown Men Gaming. My name is Ozzy Mac. Your name is... Well, don't be rude. Tell me what your name is. Okay, now you're just weird. You're just talking to a TV at this point. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for tuning in. I know it's been a while since we've made a video. I'm very sorry about that, but we are in one of my favorite games and a game that I've been really looking forward to playing. It's called Sid Meier's Pirate. Now, the original version of this game was made in 1987. Uh, for, I believe, the Atari, uh, but this is the 2004 PC remake, or no, it was 1987 for the PC, but it was like kind of a uh, top-down, black and white, really back-to-basics game, but this is the remake for the PC, it was made in 2004, and I'm so excited to play it. I've seen some playthroughs of this, so I will know a few things, uh, how to do things and stuff like that, so that might make it a little bit easier, to be honest, uh, but time to name our pirate. All right, well, I'm going to stick to what I know and make this personal, and he's going to be named Ozzy... No. <laughs> that would get so annoying. The only reason I'm not going to do something like that is because you have to see it every five seconds, and that would uh, it'd kill me. Ozzy Mac. All right. You need to sign on as part of a crew. The captains at yonder tables will gladly take you aboard. So, I love pirates. Oh. Oh. Hello, gentlemen. You're not menacing whatsoever with your little stairs and the... Uh, you got a little... You got a knife on that table over there. Nice, I like it. Okay, so here's where we have our choice. So we can either sign aboard with the English, the Dutch, the Spanish, or the French. Personally, I love the idea of being like a conquistador. And I think that that sounds amazing. But English would make a... Uh, what would Captain Jack Sparrow do? They need to make that like a bracelet. What WWCJSD? What would Captain Jack Sparrow? <laughs> oh man, I'm weird. Okay, cool. Uh, but yeah, so we have the option of the French, the Spanish, the Dutch, or the English. I don't like. Uh, I don't know. Uh, yeah. All right, we're going with Spanish. Oh. All right. Welcome aboard, Mr. Ozzy Mac. Thank you. The crossing was fraught with terror and cruelty. Oh, sorry, sorry. The captain drove the stick. The <laughs> he drives stick. <laughs> the ship near breaking. Captain's a weird, cruel dude. All right, that's all you gotta know. All right, what's going on? Oh my gosh! This means mutiny! Yeah, that's right. Oh! I feel like I'm watching a movie. Where am I? Okay, that's nice and all. Where am I? Oh. Haha! -ha! <laughs> I love how they just stopped fighting because uh, the captain shot off that cannon. He's just like, all right, later, later, Ozzy. I know you got to do this. Oh, yeah! I drop kicked the captain in the face. That's how we do things. All right, cool. 
So wait, I just got the ship because of that? That's how easy it is to get a ship. All you have to do is slide down a rope and drop kick the captain in the face. Um, you make your way into the Caribbean. Hey, hey. I don't know what that look was. I'm not gonna do that again, sorry. All right, a fortune to be had, a family to rescue. So the main goal of this game, as far as I understand it, is to rescue your family and also uh, take down all of the evil pirates, all the top pirates. Oh, how convenient. I just happen to have a picture of my family right there. <laughs> I always love that in movies, like uh, Back to the Future, movies like that, where it's like you just happen to have a picture of your family, which fits the plot. Oh, where am I? Veracruz. Oh, so this is the Spanish capital. Okay, so I start out with the Spanish, uh, but as the game progresses, I can switch my alliances. And uh, since I'm a pirate, you know, I don't really have an alliance to a country per se. But okay, let's see. Capital Veracruz. I can talk to the governor. I can visit the tavern, trade with the merchant, check sass. Well, I don't really know what I'm doing yet, so I'm gonna talk to the governor, see what he has to say. Ready? Ah, my dear oh. Ozzy Mac, please come in. Wow, I look wretched. I look like a mustard bottle. You may be interested to know that we are at war with the greedy Dutch. That's nice. I am pleased to offer a letter of Marquis, which... Marquet? Mark? I don't know. Authorize you to plunder and sink the ships of our enemies. Not only am I a pirate, I am an authorized certified pirate. Goodbye, Mr. Ozzymac. Goodbye, random Spanish dude. Okay, so we're going to visit the tavern. So in this game, you have these simple options. It's not really a complex game, per se. Uh, but you can visit the tavern, and you've got this creepy dude in the back corner. Oh gosh, what do you want from me? You have this lady here, this lovely lady right here. Then you have the barkeep. So let's see, what does he got to say? Have you been introduced to the governor of Villa Hermosa's, or sorry, Villa Hermosa's daughter? Isn't that, isn't that village of sister? Da I don't know. They say she's a real beauty. Oh, fantastic. Are you going to introduce me? No, you're just going to tell me about her. Oh, thanks. Great wingman. Great wingman. All right, let's see what she has to say. Rock Brasiliano, the seventh most notorious pirate in the Caribbean, sails out of the pirate haven La Creek near the city of Villa Hermosa. He's known to carry over 2,400 gold doubloons. Arg! All right, so he is right around here, actually, because uh, we're here. Um, La Creek is right here. Fantastic. Okay, cool. So I'll keep on the lookout for him. I don't know if I want to take on the seventh most deadly pirate, you know? Uh, sell you part of a secret map showing the location. Oh, so this is another thing. You can collect pieces of maps that show you where buried treasure is located. Yes, this is that game. Uh, but I don't want to take it right now because I don't have a lot of money and I need to save. All right, let's see what we got going here. 28 local men. That looks like four. There's a lot of dudes in the background, but 28 local men uh, want to join my crew. Why not? Sure, come on on. I don't even know what the name of my ship is. What what's the name of my ship? The citizens of Veracruz have gathered at the tavern this evening, blah blah blah, including the fact that you your inquiries here are complete. Fantastic. Okay, so what else can I do? I can talk with the merchant here, but I don't really have oh I do have a lot of money. Okay, well it looks like I have three months of food. Should I go ahead and buy some more food? Nah, I think we're good. We're in Spanish waters, so we're okay for now. The way this game works, uh, remember how he said the Spanish are at war with the uh, Dutch, I believe? Then that means that I can't go to Dutch cities and openly trade with the merchant because I'm Spanish at this point. Uh, you know I'm Spanish with a name like Ozzy Mac. Uh, all right, so let's see what we got going here. Right now we have three months of food uh, and eight cannons, and we also have 68 crew. So that's gonna come in handy later whenever we start actually fighting some dudes, but we can't fight dudes at dock So let's go. Oh Wow, this is a weird control system. Okay, so it's literally the number pad uh, To control this I take it. I want to go away from the storms. I Have no fame. It's got to be said because I haven't done anything yet uh, So what's here? Governor encourages plundering Dutch ships Okay, so I need to find some Dutch ships. All right, sorry about that. A little bit of technical difficulties. I clicked outside of the window like an idiot. Okay, so we are here. No, we're not. Where are we? Okay, so we're here. We're in like the western Via Hermosa. That's where we just came from. So where are the Dutch is the better question. Uh, okay, I don't know what the Dutch flag looks like. I believe it's this orange one here, which means that we're nowhere near the Dutch right now. And everyone here is Spanish. We're in, like, completely friendly waters right now. 
Okay. All right. Well, I am a pirate, so I will go find trouble. We're far out to sea. Shall I set a... Oh, okay. So... Hmm. Actually... Didn't he say that there was gonna... Oh. Is that a bet? No, that's... That's Spanish. Hold up. Let's, let's go ahead and visit... Uh, no, we don't really need to visit ports, do we? We're gonna go back to Veracruz. I, I wanna talk to Veracruz real quick. I wanna see what's going on. Because I don't see any Dutch ships, per se. Governor, what up? As you know, we're at war with the greedy Dutch. Okay, that's all he has to say to me for now. Just, uh, it's all about you, isn't it? It's just always all about you. Okay, fine. Okay, so we're gonna sail away. And we're gonna head on out. And we're gonna try to find some Dutch to kill. Alright? Alright. So I take it riding into a storm is bad. Where should we go? So are we only at war with the Dutch? So the Dutch are the only people I have to worry about? So maybe I can, uh... Maybe I can go to the English. Okay, I said set sails for that. Did you actually... Are we anywhere near them? No, we are still over the... What? But I, I just said set... Okay. Alright, I guess we're, uh... Oh, whoa, hello. We're, we're Spanish. We're Spanish. Don't mind us. All right. It's the pirate's life for me, man. This is amazing. They're Spanish. See, the thing is, I don't want to attack the Spanish yet because I don't have a lot. I only have eight cannons, so it's not like I can take on the Spanish at this point. And if I remember this game correctly, they will find out if I sink one of their ships. They will know about it immediately, and I will lose all ties with anyone. So I don't want to do that just yet, but bear with me. I will be a piratey pirate at some point where I will start attacking everyone. Yaxchalan, the friendly Indian village. Okay, so what can we do here? Oh my gosh. Our warriors grow tired of this presence of the European colonists. I'm not Spanish. Compet which city is weak and ripe for destruct? Oh. I'm not gonna do anything. I'm very scared, honestly. And I'm, I know I'm playing this game cautiously, I'm sorry. But I don't wanna mess it up this early on. <laughs> uh, to be completely honest. Uh, okay, so we have 68, oh. Friendly Jesuit mission. What is, what is a Jesuit mission? Hold up, what can I do here? Uh, Santa Nina is baking in the sun. Let's talk to the abbot. I believe you have a sister who's been missing for many years. Raimondo has information which will be of great value to you. At this moment, he is hiding in the city of St. Augustine. I feel like he is, like, the boss, though. I don't think I can take him on just yet. I really just need to, like, practice on some people. If I can find a single ship that's not Spanish, then I would love to start practicing. Okay, where am I, first off? Okay, let's see. So, I'm I'm still over... We're not even... We haven't even made progress. Alright, so I just found out that my men are apparently starving. Uh, because I forgot... Being the guy that I am, I forgot to check their food. We are nowhere near any... Oh, gosh. Okay, I'm gonna have to try to make it. Oh, I have to try to make it to uh, a friendly Spanish settlement before my men starve and more than likely commit mutiny. But I don't have a very fast ship. Oh, this is going to be fun. Uh, all right, here we go. Here we go. Pirate Haven. I don't know if... I mean, I'm a pirate, but are they okay with me as a person? Apparently, Captain Kidd is at sea. Okay, I'm going to have to trade with the merchant because I need food. All right, so he's got eight tons of food. Fantastic. Buy food for, okay, we're gonna buy some foods. All right, we got two months. It's not bad, not bad. Oh, Captain Kit, oh, oh no. No way, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh no, no, wait. Oh, they're Spanish. Okay, we're good, we're good. Oh God, I've been recording for 19 minutes and all I have to show for it are these sweet dolphins following my ship. Right on. Yo ho, yo ho, pirate's life for me. 
I am sailing, I am sailing through the waters overseas. And we're back. Uh, so a lot of nothing just happened there. Uh, it wasn't even really worth showing you guys. But what has just happened is I went to a random French town because I had to get some food for my crew. And he's decided that I'm going to protect his ship. Uh, so what are we doing? We're going to Tortuga and I have to protect his ship from whatever happens. I don't know if I'm the right person for the job, but you know what? We're going to try it. So who am I protecting it from? He's French, so they're not going to attack him. So am I literally just going... Oh, he's following me. Okay, gotcha. Well, we are full sails. I don't know who the French are at war with, so uh, I'm a bit... Oh, they're taking him down, bro. All right, we're in battle. They said it would never happen, but it's a happen... Oh, gosh. Oh. Do we have that kind of range? Yeah, we do. Oh, they steered away from that. Oh... Hello. Oh, they're gonna ram us. Oh, we might be screwed, guys. Oh, no. All right. All right. Oh. Oh! I do not know how to fight the sword. Chop and chop. Aha! Jump and chop. Chopping for days. Yeah, that's right. That's how you pirate in Austin Town. All right, cool. So we're gonna do this, and then we're gonna chop, and we're gonna chop him off the ship. No, we're not. We're gonna do the. Th we're gonna. We're gonna duck, and then we're gonna chop, and he is out of there. Yeah. Okay, how many men did I lose? I wasn't even paying attention. That was my first sword battle. Ozzy Mac is a pirate. Fantastic. Everyone's so happy. Right on. Okay, so one of the pirate crewmen is a skilled copper. Cooper. Cooper. What's a cooper? Who can preserve food in sturdy barrels. Apparently a cooper preserves food in sturdy barrels. Fantastic. He's quickly persuaded to join our crew. Yeah, volunteer. Welcome aboard, lads. Fantastic. All right, so how much crew did we lose? I'm a bit scared of that. So, okay, whenever you take over a ship, um, you can get whatever's on the ship. So we're going to take all the foods... Oh my gosh, they had so much food. All right, we have so much space though. Oh, we have 23 months of food, that's fantastic. Okay, and we are going to take the guns. Uh, hmm. I think we're gonna sink her. Yeah, forget it. We're sinking it. Oh wait, we don't have enough. Okay, well that's fine. All right, we're good. News of your victory spreads quickly. The English governor of Port Royal may be inclined to give you a promotion next time you're in town. Fantastic. Okay, cool. So, transporting the new governor. He's going to Tortuga, and that's a quest done. Right on. Sweet. Okay, so let's go visit Tortuga. All right. So, we're going to talk to the governor. Yeah, you like how I transported you here? Yeah. My dear Ozzy Mac, you may be interested to know that we are at war with the perfidious English. Wait, why do the English like me? Because I transported... Oh, I think that pirate ship was doing something. I don't know. There's a new governor in Tortuga, and you captured a pirate brig. Excellent, the king will be pleased. Offer a letter of Marquet, which, allow, with author, yeah, which authorizes you to plunder and sink the ships of our enemies. As this map will show, the nearest enemy city is the English city of Port Royal. Oh... See, here's where I have to make decisions, because I'm Spanish, but the French love me now because I transported their new governor, uh, but the English like me as well. So I have to decide, do I want the English or the French? Okay, so they want, what do they want me to do to Point Royal? They want me to like take it over? You know what? No, no. I decided at the very beginning that English was going to be my second, second peeps. So I'm going to stick with my good relations with the English. Okay, so what do you have to say? Bartender scratched his head, the evil Baron Raimondo. Last I heard, he had left St. Augustine. He's the one that has my sister and family, supposedly. Or at least he has information on it. Okay, so he is going towards Santiago. Oh, crap, he's right here. 
Should I take him on now? I'm not sure. I don't know if I've built up myself enough. Okay, what do you have to say? I should know the Baron Raimondo sails in the Spanish War Gown the Fama. Okay, I'm finding out so many things about him. All right, let's see. Band of eight men, welcome aboard. More the merrier. I think that brings our crew up to about 80 something? I don't know. Let's see, 48. They're unhappy. Why are they unhappy? What the heck? Okay. How do I make them happy? We've been at sea for 10 months. Probably because I starved them earlier. That, that probably didn't help at all. Okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and cut off this episode here. You kind of got a feel for the series. It's going to be fantastic. I love this. I love pirates. Pirate games are amazing. And this is one of the best pirate games I've ever seen. The uh, the awesome Aussie Mac. Hold up. I'm going to see what we can do real quick. Um, upgrade copper. I want to be able to rename my ship. Because right now it's named the Revenge. Which is nice and all. But it definitely doesn't have that Aussie Mac grown men gaming touch. Which I heavily agree with. But, okay, well, anyways, I'm going to end this episode here. We'll come right back to it. But, yeah, if you like this series, please uh, like and subscribe right down below. Share this video with your friends. If you like me, hi. <laughs> um, right on. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm so sorry it's been so long since we uploaded a video last time. We've had some software issues. We've had some issues with the recording. But we're looking to fix that. And we're going to keep putting out videos for now. I really want to upgrade in the near future, but that's what we're having issues with. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And if you liked it, please like and subscribe down below. Share Grown Men Gaming. Go to Facebook.com slash Grown Men Gaming and uh, like us there. Right on. Well, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.